Speaker number two, Eric Coverson. In with the old. In with the old, Eric Coverson. Even as we speak, I am being pursued by a nefarious organization that is just hell bent on world domination. The AARP. <laughs> Mr. Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, and as anyone else who's over the age of 50 can attest, getting older sucks. <laughs> they promised me discounts on all kinds of medication, including Viagra. <laughs> now, like every other man in this room, I don't need that stuff. <laughs> However, in the interest of science, <laughs> I decided to conduct my own at-home clinical trial. <laughs> so in the one cup, I have the Viagra, and the other cup, I have a placebo. Well, technically, it was rum and coke. <laughs> know if all of this stuff is linked, but at the same time I was getting these emails from the AARP, I started getting other emails with the subject line that said, date single women over 50. <laughs> hey, I just got here. <laughs> I am not trying to be the back daddy of the senior circuit. <laughs> point is, you know, it's not how you look always, it's also how you feel. And at age 50, things are different. Like, there was a time when if I said, you're not the boss of me, I was probably talking to my older brother. Today, I'm talking to my bladder. <laughs> You know what's worse than being past middle age? It's being past middle age and still dating. <laughs> I, I met this woman a few weeks ago, and I told her, I'm 50 years old, never been married, and don't have any kids. What did she say to me? What's wrong with you? <laughs> Ladies, that is so unfair. What does anything have to be wrong with me? I mean, am I a man or a carton of cottage cheese? Is, I mean, is there a, a date stamp on my back that says, best if used by? Whoa, 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 stall them. Tell, tell them I am not here. Tell them I'm at the gym, pumping iron. Oh, God. Oh, I can't keep running. I give up. Now, I can't believe they traced me to here. I mean, the last place I expected AARP to show up was Toastmasters. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Are you sure they're here for me? 